In the last few decades, astronomers have discovered thousands of new worlds. Exoplanets of all shapes and sizes, orbiting distant stars. But it seems that there was an undiscovered planet hidden under our noses all along. It was found orbiting a red dwarf star called Proxima Centauri, which is our solar system's closest stellar neighbour. The star may be nearby, but it's so faint it can only be seen as a red blur in a telescope. For the past few years, astronomers have been peering at its dim and inconsistent light, looking for the telltale patterns that could indicate the presence of planets. A planet's gravity can physically move the star it orbits, despite the size difference between them. As the planet circles, the star wobbles. This slight movement can be detected from Earth as a change in the colour of the starlight. The light shifts slightly towards blue, then slightly towards red, as the star moves towards and away from us, over and over. When telescopes were pointed towards Proxima Centauri, they revealed exactly this kind of signal, a cycle of changing starlight, repeating every 11.2 days. At first, astronomers couldn't be sure that it wasn't just an illusion, natural variations in the star's activity. But as they returned night after night to the same patch of sky, a pattern appeared that could not be dismissed. From nothing more than a distant blurry light, astronomers have now deduced the presence of an exoplanet, named, for now, Proxima b. We don't know much about what this new world is like. We think that it's small and rocky, probably slightly bigger than the Earth. A year on Proxima b is only 11 days long. It's closer to its star than Earth is to the Sun, but because its star is seven times smaller than our Sun, the temperature on the surface shouldn't be too extreme. In fact, it could even hold liquid water. Proxima Centauri is much more violent than the Sun. Its stellar flares bombard the planet with X-rays, electrons, protons and other particles. It may be that this onslaught has long since scoured the planet of any water it started with. Or, like the Earth, its atmosphere and maybe a magnetic field could have protected it. This small rocky planet, sitting bang in the middle of the so-called habitable zone of its star, could be a lot like Earth, which means that Proxima b may not only be the closest planet outside our solar system, but also a prime candidate in our search for life. With current technology, it would take us tens of thousands of years to travel the 4.2 light years between us and our new neighbour. But if we do develop a fast enough way to explore the galaxy, Proxima b could be our very first stop. <laughs>